My name is Vinny with Overalls Detail, and this is my YouTube channel. Hey, what's up, guys? It's Vinny with Vinny Details and Overalls Detail. Um, we're out here today with my maintenance client's uh, house, and today we're doing a tutorial. So the tutorial today is simply going to be cleaning mats. Something so simple, but um, something that we can relearn or beginner detailers. Let's begin to learn it uh, on how to clean mats mobily without an extractor. Okay, so um, obviously some things are super bad and you uh, need an extractor to get that junk and pull it out. All right, but when you're mobile doing maintenance clients or you're just doing a, 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 a detail, let's uh, make sure that we do it right. All right, so here it is. We're gonna go to these mats and uh, show you how we get it done. But like I Oscar, they nigga trash. Hey, like Oscar, misplaced property. Hey, hey, they nigga bitches a royalty. Pay me. All right, so um, I'm gonna show you guys uh, two ways of doing this. Okay. Um, so we have here the Dewalt rotary with a drill uh, with a brush, okay? Um, we also have a regular brush. You can get this at the dollar store for a dollar, okay? Um, the mixture here that I use is something that I've already came up with and I love it. I haven't found anything better. And this is simply um, some 50% um, uh, degreaser, 50% vinegar, okay? I love it, it works um, and that's what it is. So we also are gonna have here a dry rag because this stain here, once the, 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 the um, that liquid comes up, you kinda wanna wipe it, but it's not always necessary, okay? Um, so let's get to it. Uh, what I'm gonna do here, these have already been vacuumed, okay? So you wanna vacuum them. You want to also, if they have a lot of sand or hair on them, you wanna make sure that you address that, okay? Um, we're gonna do another video about dog hair and pet hair but we'll get to that so you want to just run this a little bit so we make sure that we get all that sand out um, before you start this process okay so we always want to do that so let's go ahead I'm gonna show you this one here um, it's a little bit worse so I'm gonna show you um, what we do here with um, this uh, stain and I'm for this one we're gonna use the rotary Okay, so we just to make sure we want to get it covered nice, okay? Um, what we're going to do is we're going to get this, uh, um, the rotary. It's at 600, which is the lowest um, speed, okay? And then we are going to get started. Now you see how that... Um, foam is rising up a little bit so if you have dirt and you haven't vacuumed the car or that stain is still pretty fresh and there's still moisture in there that's going to come up right and when that comes up when that comes up it's really going to um, spread across that's why you want to come in with the rag and make sure that you get some of that moisture out right get some of that moisture out just come back up one more time just to make sure that we get it and i like to do things in a pattern so you can see i'm more uh, moving horizontally up and down kind of the same way you would polish the car and then i'm going to go vertically um right here just to make sure we cover all the bases okay and detailing um patterns are very uh, important so you don't miss things all right, so that is the result right there, right? I like how that comes up. It's really good. Um, that machine works really well, okay? Um, so what am I gonna do now is we're going to do this one here. Let me move back, bow, bow, bow. Okay, so this one we're going to do with the dollar brush. It still works. Actually, this was the worst one, which I couldn't really do with the machine. But let's do it anyway, because it'll still come up, okay? So we saw that stain was right here, and it's spreading a little bit, okay? 
meaning that it was still fresh. What we're gonna do is we're gonna come out and take a little bit of this off, okay? With the rag. So the rag is pulling that dirt off. Get some more here. So we're still getting a little darkness here. As you can see, the tools are going to make you a effective and time efficient detailer or it's just going to kill you some time. And that's okay if you don't have too much going on, you have time to get the job done right and you're missing some pieces of equipment, that's all right, you can still get the job done. Okay, it's just gonna take you a little bit more arm strength and a little bit more time. And that's totally okay. All right. There we go. I think that looks pretty good. All right. Yeah. Looking for the truth, and boy, you better send them to me. Send them to me. Middle campus, fucked around and thought I had the answers. Uh. Till I realized my fucking life was all in shambles. Got 30 candles. And now, for everyone's favorite part, as they always love to enjoy this, is the lines. Make them however you like. If your client likes them, great. If he doesn't, don't make them. Uh, it depends on the client. Most of my clients love the lines makes the car look fresh and kind of new all right so lines are just if you're too add you might have a little issue getting lines done This month's rent trying to fuck on some sluts Ass so fat, it only took a minute to bust Trust, I dealt with heartbreak and damn it, it sucks it does. Nigga still ain't found love, but well acquainted the lust uh. Took my last love fling out to the DR for a How'd you guys like that tutorial? Did it help you guys at all? Um, do you guys understand the dilution between degreaser and vinegar? Do you guys uh, use something else? So let me know, uh, go in the comments, start a conversation. Let me know what process you use. Let me know what products you're using. Um, if you use a drill brush, um, shout out to uh, Wilson Out of Detail, came out with his own drill brushes. I'm gonna get me one soon, um, but uh, let me know. All right, hope you guys enjoyed the video. S press that subscribe button, um, press that like button, share it. If you guys know any beginner detailers, um, share it with them. And uh, it's an amazing thing to be able to teach somebody how to do something. And the point of this YouTube channel is for um, me to teach you guys something, but it'll be highly beneficial if you guys teach me something as well. So let me know um, what process you use, what products you use. I would love to get a conversation going and try new things. All right, guys, I uh, hope you have a great uh, and blessed week. Um, this is Vinny with Overalls Detail, Vinny Details. My name is Vinny with Overalls Detail, and this is my YouTube channel.